Well, it feels good to be back home and get back on the winning track. And, you know, we – that was a very tough stretch there the last couple weekends for us, just having to play the toughest teams in our league on the road and being so close in all three of our losses. So, um, just good to be home. And the shots didn't all fall, but I thought we defended really well tonight. And, you know, Detroit is a much improved team that has beaten IUPUI and um, had some really big wins here as of late and have played a lot better. So I thought we just did a really nice job of handling them and um, playing our game and kind of getting back to what makes us us, getting out in transition and defending really well. So the time that Irving got some key minutes uh, in the first half and some more time late in the fourth were three blocks on the night. Uh, what kind of stood out to you uh, for her performance? Well, it's nice to have somebody that can come in off the bench and give Emmy a little breather. You know, Emmy – has a tough job every night to get be in there guarding the other team's best post player. And, um, you know, she's pretty much – she and Taya are the only size that we have. So, Taya did a great job at Cleveland State when we needed her. We had to have her because of foul trouble and had nine blocks and ten rebounds. And, um, you know, she's so long and athletic that defensively she alters a lot of things. So, um, you know, being able to go with her off the bench and, and um, provide some key minutes is, is crucial for us, especially here. You know, we've got these one-day turnarounds and, and just trying to find just a little bit of rest for these guys um, in the first game. That way we can be ready for the second game come Saturday. Ivy, three seals for me tonight. Uh, the team's eight. Uh, it seems like the team was uh, kind of mixing up looks on D all night. How big was that for you? Uh, it was really big. Um, we always try to be aggressive, uh, whether we're in two or in five. So I just think eight steals for us is, is a good thing for us. So we just got to continue to um, be aggressive uh, every game. Mari, uh, 15 points uh, for you on the night. Uh, it's kind of working for you on the uh, I just saw a whole bunch of openings whenever I would drive in, or I'll just wait for the ball to get swung around a couple of times, and I would see an opening, and I would just try my best to get into the hole or try to dish it off to a teammate. Uh, just a question for all three. Uh, Kamari drew seven fouls tonight. Uh, Ivy drew six. Uh, and Coach, you can kind of comment on this too. Just, I mean, you guys find yourselves, I mean, kind of in all season two, just find yourselves in, you know, just every play that kind of happens out there. You know, kind of, you can just talk about that, just, you know, where you're out on the court and just how you're pretty much involved in just everything out there. <laughs> it's interesting. Go ahead, Ivy. <laughs> I'll start. Um, I, you know, we really emphasize getting in the paint. So playing inside out, getting into the post players or our guards getting in with two feet and really attacking and getting to the foul line. We want to make more free throws than the other team attempts is always our goal every game. And um, I'd like for us to shoot a little bit better from the foul line. But to shoot 32 free throws in a game is huge. And not only is it good for us offensively, but it puts the other team at a disadvantage defensively because now they're in foul trouble, they're playing hesitantly, they're having to go deep into the bench, which they had to do tonight. And um, so that's always our goal and always our emphasis is to attack and get in the paint. Yeah, like when we shoot a lot of free throws, I think that kind of gets us going as a team. Like we're obviously attacking and drawing fouls, so I just think uh, getting to the free throw line uh, is a big thing for us because it gets us going, I think. Yeah, whenever we get and ones from attacking, I feel like that picks up our energy even more because um, everybody gets excited, even the bench players, everybody on the court gets so excited about it, which pumps up our energy. Uh, I was just like going into uh, Saturday, obviously, senior day, uh, what's the focus of the team or the message to the team going into tournament play next week? Well, we still got one regular season game left. And, you know, we talked about that even tonight, that we can't, we can't be looking forward. Um, this is our last regular season game. This is possibly our last home game. And so um, we want to send these four season seniors out on a high note. And that's really the only message, is to go out and continue to get better, just the same way we've done all year. That's always been our message, just continuing our process. And we're in our second season. We have our non-conference, and we've got conference play. And then we've got postseason. And so um, we're just focused on wrapping up uh, the, the conference play and conference schedule and going out on a high note to get a little bit of momentum going into the tournament.